Hello, Jessica Frost Ballas here with a video for Honeybee Stamps. Today I'm sharing an easy but striking retirement or get well card featuring the new Adventure Awaits release. So let's get started. I'm using the Lakeside Scene Builder die set with the At the Lake layering stencil set. They can be used on their own or combined for a stencil dimensional design. To start, I take a piece of white cardstock and run the Lakeside Scene Builder die through my die cutting machine. The die cuts the mountain top and embosses lots of fun details into the scene. Next, I place my first stencil layer over the die cut panel using the etched lines in the stencil to line it up with the die cut edges. I'm using my hands to hold things in place, but you could also tape the stencil down for extra security. I blend Rustic Wilderness Distress Oxide ink lightly over the trees and grass of the first layer. Then I lift the stencil and line up the next stencil layer. I use the same Rustic Wilderness Distress Oxide ink for this layer, but I use a much heavier hand for a dark foresty green. This helps give the forest a little dimension. Then I use Forest Moss for the next layer, and then add a little Rustic Wilderness on top to soften that bright green but still let it be different than my first set of trees. For the fourth layer, I use hickory smoke for the shorter mountain and tree trunks. On the fifth layer, I use soft stone with a little hickory smoke for the other mountain. Then I blend Uncharted Mariner and Chip Sapphire on the lake. On the final layer, I start by using forest moss and rustic wilderness on the trees. Then I take a panel of white cardstock and blend tumbled glass and broken china distress oxide ink over one side to create my sky. I layer my die cut panel over the blended sky and then line up the final stencil layer again. I blend Broken China Distress Oxide ink over the sky. Next I trim down the edges of the die cut panel and adhere it to the blended sky panel. Then I trim it all down to a horizontal A2 card measuring five and a half by four and a quarter. Off camera, I stamp a sentiment from the new Be Still 6x6 stamp set and die cut it with a coordinating die. Then I use liquid glue to adhere it to the card. 
I love all the details of this gorgeous lakeside scene, and this can easily be used for a Father's Day card, retirement card, get well card, or just anytime you want to create a beautiful scene. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed today's video, and if you did, I'd love for you to give it a thumbs up and leave a comment. Be sure to subscribe to the Honeybee Stamps channel for even more crafty inspiration. Thanks so much for watching, and until next time, have an amazing day and happy crafting. Bye!